How's it going everybody, Gold Hat here and welcome back to the channel. This is going to be entry 11 of my Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War walkthrough guide and in this entry we are going to be focusing on Operation Chaos. So a little bit about Operation Chaos, this is a side mission and if we complete this we can get an achievement slash trophy which we will be doing now. I'm going to be covering all aspects of this so the best way to do this in my opinion is beat the game and then go back to mission select and do the Cuba briefing. Once you're at the Cuba briefing we can just come back to this board and once we're at this board we can examine the evidence for that Operation Chaos. Once you pull this up on Operation Chaos, you will What's notice that? that there are three pieces of evidence that we will need to get. I am going to be covering all three of these real quick. The first one that we are going to be covering is going to be in the first mission of the game. So if you just pull back out onto this board and you go at the bottom left, we will have nowhere left to run. You want to start up this mission and I will show you how to get that piece of evidence. At the beginning of this mission, you will go into a bar. After you're done with the bar and you get a gun out of the trunk, you are going to get all the way to the rooftops and you are going to do some interrogations. Now, the way to get this piece of evidence is to not throw him off the roof. There is going to be an option here to throw him and you want to avoid that. You want to go straight to just talking to him and then he will stand up. Once he stands up, you will be rewarded your piece of evidence. Then you can just shoot him and you are ready to move on. The next thing I want to talk about is as soon as you pick up these pieces of evidence you can quit the level you do not need to finish out these levels as soon as you get it you can just go back to main menu go to your campaign mission select back to the cuba briefing and go back up to the board and go on to your next mission so once we have done that we're just going to go back to this board and we are ready to look at our next piece of evidence you ready you look ready Now the next piece of evidence that we need to grab is some tape. It is going to be at this mission right here on the far right and that is going to be a brick in the wall. We want to start up this mission and we are ready to get our next piece of evidence. So once you start this mission, you will be on a train. You are going to follow Adler off the train. You are going to go through the tunnel. You will arrive on a rooftop. Once you're on that rooftop, you will take a picture. Once you get done with that, you will have to go into a bar and do some reconnaissance. Once you have done that, you will go through the bathroom. You'll go out the window, and this is where I'm going to pick up the gameplay right here. We are going to make our way to the next piece of evidence. I'm going to show you the path now, and I will talk to you once we get there. That's a feel in the Schon gut, schon gut. Aber sie können meine Wohnung von hier aus sehen. Ist der weg? Meet me in the building across from your current position. Keep a low profile, we already have enough trouble. Ich untersuche das. Ich hab gar nichts versucht. So once we're on this scaffold, we can just jump down and we are going to see this door right here that says 732. We just want to lock pick this and we're going to go in. There's going to be three guards that we're going to take out real quick and we will find our piece of evidence right on this desk. Just, 
So real quick, one more time, after you grab that piece of evidence, you can quit the level. You do not need to finish it. You can just go to quit, go to campaign, and then mission select the Cuba briefing. Go back up to the board and you will have it. So next up is going to be the red light, green light evidence. And this is going to be our last piece of evidence. If you need the three photo Intel locations, I have that in entry four. So if you just go to my channel, you can click on that entry, entry four, and I will show you all three of those locations. There is six in total, but you only need three to get the evidence. Once you have gotten all three pieces of evidence, we need to examine them. Once you pull up the newspaper, you are going to see some letters that are going to turn red for you. These are going to spell out an area. Now, you can go back over here to this tape and you just need to align those letters in this here. So those letters are not going to be in order. You just need to write down those letters and see which letters match up to one of these words. Mine was easy. It was Miami. This is going to be different for everybody, but in this playthrough, it was Miami. So right after you figure out the location that it spells, the numbers on the right is going to be half of the password. So just write those numbers down real quick. Mine was 3020 and we are ready to move on to the next piece of evidence. Next up is going to be a coded message and these are going to be different for everybody. Now there are going to be red numbers and blue numbers and there will also be a red question mark and a blue question mark. Basically this is just a simple math problem. You just need to figure out the math riddle and figure out which numbers are going to be in those question marks. So for example, real quick, the red letters were just plus two, plus four, plus six, plus eight. And that is how you figure that out. The blue numbers were just plus four all the way. Once you add all those up, it will match. And that way you can get your numbers. You want to take your numbers back to this broadcast and figure out the word that it will spell. You want to match the numbers to the right and look at the word for the left. Now you want to decrypt the floppy disk. Once you do that, your first numbers right here is going to be what you got off the newspaper. You want to put here, which mine was 3020. And then right after that, you want to spell out whatever word it was for that cryptic message. Mine was Raleigh and I'm going to put that in and we are ready to go. Hell yeah, that's it. You did it, Bell. Now that we got what we need, we can safely move on all So after you decrypted that floppy disk, we can actually launch the Operation Chaos mission. I'm going to be playing through this whole mission. Right afterwards, we will get our achievement slash trophy for completing this side mission. They'll be handling this one. Our source tells us that Aldrich is about to move south across Colorado and into northern New Mexico. That's where we're intercept his convoy. We can't let a former CIA operative run a person spy factory. Let's put this asshole six feet under. I can't believe Aldrich betrayed the CIA. Betrayed the whole fucking country. Phoenix 2-4, this is Phoenix 2-1, 30 seconds out. We're up, Mason. Locked and loaded.
And now that we have completed this side mission, we will get our achievement slash trophy, Operation Chaos. And that is going to be closing out Entry 11. As always, I hope this walkthrough guide has been super helpful. If it has been, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. If you have any questions at any time, feel free to drop a comment down below. Or you can hit me up personally on my Instagram. The link is in the description box. And I'll see you guys next time. Gold Hat, signing off.